thank you for being my family when my family wasn't there. Tonight, a woman injured during a shooting rampage in Lake City in the spring finally got to thank one of the police officers who saved her. And King 5's Ted Land joins us with more on what was a really emotional reunion, Ted. Joyce and Mark, a lot of us remember this dark day back in March when a gunman opened fire on drivers in Lake City. Two people were killed, two were wounded. Tonight, one of those victims took an important step on her journey of healing. Debbie Judd remembers very little of that day back in March when a gunman approached her car in Lake City during a shooting rampage and pulled the trigger. But she can still hear a voice of reassurance. I remember your voice saying, nope, that's not happening. We're here. We're okay. We're all over this place. That was the voice of SPD officer Tyler Poole, who found Judd bleeding and applied a tourniquet. He stayed with her, making sure she was okay as she was rushed to the hospital. For us, the people that you run into help, it is meaningful. Um, thank you so much for caring. Thank you so much for running into places that are scary. Judd reunited with Officer Poole during an event Thursday evening. When you're laying on the road shot, the police are your family because no matter how good your friends and family are, they're not there. Judd, an elementary school teacher, is taking some time off as she continues to recover physically and emotionally. And this is a big piece of healing to put in place. For the officers who put their lives in danger, this is one of those moments when they're reminded of how much their work matters. But this is a perfect example of, I think, why the majority of us do the job. Tonight's event was hosted by Seattle Hockey Partners. That's the group trying to bring an NHL team to the city. They surprised SPD officer Poole with season tickets to the league's first season here, but there was a condition. He has to bring Debbie Judd to opening night. Oh my gosh. They were also raising it's money amazing. and donating money to the Seattle Police Foundation. That's a nonprofit that buys equipment for Seattle police officers, including the tourniquet that saved her life that they used on her at the shooting scene. I love oh. what she said that they're your family because sometimes your family. They're the is first not ones there. there. Yeah. Yeah. And they oh. are. Right? Great story, Ted. Thanks.